हाय फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू दी चैनल एंड शैकलिंग सुडोकूज एंड पजल्स आशीष हेयर एंड टुडे आई एल बी कवरिंग अ सुडोको वेरिएंट इट्स अ काइंड ऑफ अ किलर वेरिएंट सुडोको बाय इट्रियो सो द नेम इट हैज बीन नेम बाय डिस्पाइट ऑल माय रेज सो नेम बाय द ऑथर एंड सो वी विल बी सॉल्विंग टू सुडोकूज टुडे वन वुड बी 6 बाय 6 दैट यू आर सीइंग राइट नाउ एंड द अदर वुड हैव टू बी 9 बाय 9 so thanks a lot itrio for such a wonderful sudoku and thanks a lot for the permission uh, i am really glad that we could cover a video uh, by you on our channel so before going to this sudoku i would highly recommend you to please subscribe to uh, my channel and shackling sudokus and puzzles if you haven't done so it will really motivate us to cover videos on regular basis and if at all you have a request for any sudoku variant or a puzzle general do let us know in the comment below and we'll surely make a video on it and now coming back to this sudoku so uh, it's a killer variant sudoku killer variant i would say and uh, what are the rules of this sudoku is you need to place digits from 1 to 6 in each row each column and 2 into 3 box without repetition apart from that you have some cages with colors in it right color cells so all the same color cells will have same uh, sum in each cage so for example if the sum of these two numbers is 7 or 8 whatever Uh, the sum of all the blue cage would have to be seven or eight, right? And if uh, for the red, it says it is same for the red. So if the sum of these three numbers is, let us assume A, then the sum of these two numbers will also be A, right? And the sum may be same for both blue and red. So different colors may or may not have different sums. It is possible, right? So uh, with that, uh, let us start solving this Sudoku. Uh, seems to be a great design here. so we know that the sum of a row or a column will have to be 21 always so let us see what is the minimum sum you can have in a cage as i see a three cell so digits cannot repeat in a cage right so as i see a three cell uh, cage the minimum sum is 6 what is the maximum sum you can get of course maximum sum cannot be more than 9 cannot be 10 there are two ways to see that each row has a maximum a sum of 21 right so if you have a 10 here and a 10 here you already have 20 with these four cells which is of course not possible for a 21 uh, sum row right so the maximum sum is 9 the other way to see that you cannot have a if you have a 10 here it would be 6 4 and then you cannot have 6 4 here as well so other way to see that is okay uh, the maximum sum is 9 and the minimum sum is 6 so how do we see that so if the minimum so if the minimum sum is 6 6 would have to be here right in this uh, box second box 6 cannot be in any of the cages because the minimum sum is 6 you'll have another number uh, that will make the sum greater than 6 so which means If you have a six here, where can you have a six in box one? It will of course be inside the cage. So six sum is not possible. It is either seven, eight, or nine. Can we have the same thing for seven? I don't think nine is also possible because if you have nine, the sum of these numbers is twenty one, right? If this is nine and this is nine, which is three, four, five, and six, we'll use three, four, five, and six. You'll have one and two and one and two here, and to get this sum as nine, it, 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 they either have to have a seven or an eight. Of course, nine is not possible. That's a really good logic. So we have uh, moved down to only two possibilities: seven or eight. How do we do that? Seven or eight. So in both the cases, one has to be in a three-cell cage. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. One has to be in a three-cell cage for uh, seven or eight, right? So. Okay. 
it is 7 7 7 to be 1 2 4 if it is 8 8 and 8 would be 16 here so 6 would have to be if the sum is 8 here 1 will have to be here where can a 4 be wow what an amazing logic so if the sum is 8 in this box that's a really good breaking guys amazing breaking if the sum is 8 one cannot be in a two cell cage when the sum is eight right of course because you have numbers from one to six so one would have to be here where can a four be if you have two cell cage if you have four here you'll have four again four again and four okay so eight is not possible the sum is seven amazing logic guys amazing so it's one two four three five and six so which is four two and one for 3 it would be 4 ok 1 2 and 4 sum is 7 right whatever you have here would have to be here is it yeah, of course because whatever you have here if it is not here ok at least one if one of the cell is in the this cage the other cell also would have to be in this cage or else it cannot be in both the cells so you have only one place for that for these two numbers so whatever you have here would have to be here but is that helping us of course so if the sum is 7 whatever you have here would have to be here so these two cells are same I would say these two cells and these two cells are also same so these two cells and these two cells are same because if it is here the second digit would have to be same as this digit so of course you will have two same digits in the same row so these two and these two are same which gives you these two as same but uh, of course that is again not helping us this cell can be 3, 5 or 6, it cannot be 1, 2 or a 4 because it is seeing all the 3 cells 1, 2, 4. Whatever you have here would have to be here. No, then I... No. Okay, whatever I have here would have to be here actually. So... Of course, whatever I have here cannot be in these cells, cannot be here because then these three cells would be 3, 5, 6 and the sum will go greater than 7. So it has to be in one of these two cells, this digit and this digit. So which means this is also 3, 5, 6, this is 1, 2, 4. So this cell and this cell is the same 1, 2, 4, so it is 3, 5 and 6. Okay. Of course the sum is 7, it is 14. So if you have 1 year it would be 6, it would be, if you have 2 year it would be 5, if you have 4 year it would be 3. Okay. So this cell and this cell is same, right?
so whatever you have here would have to be here that is 3 5 and 6 so again 1 2 4 or 3 5 6 but we are not sure the sum actually if it is 3 this would be 3 this cell would be in one of these two cells so this sum is not a 7 because for the 7 you need 1 2 4 you already have a 3 5 6 can it be 6 1 2 and 3 this sum is not a 7 so it can be 6 8 9 10 So both these one to fours would have to be here. Come on, these cells are same, right? So if these cells, eight. come on come on it would have to be this cell <sighs> amazing so whatever you have here would have to be here right we have already deduced that again whatever you have here would have to be here again we have deduced that these two cells and these two cells are same so whatever you have here would have to be here which means it is one of three five and six these digits are one of three five or a six because whatever you have here would have to be here and would have to be in one of these two cells so this is one two and four again this is one two or a four so which means one of the threes would have to be in one of these two cells you cannot have both five and six because then this sum won't match Now this cannot be 3, 5 or a 6, it has to be 1, 2 or a 4, so this is 3, 5 or a 6, if it is a 4 here, 4 is not possible because the minimum sum for these two cells is 8 plus 4 is 12, uh, the sum of these two numbers cannot be 12, so it is either minimum sum is 9 10 or 11 11 is also not possible it is 9 or a 10 11 if it is 11 it would have to be 5 and 6 and both 5 and 6 cannot be here so it is either 9 or a 10 okay Ten, ten, seven, and a seven. Yeah. How much is that? Thirty-four. So for forty-two, you'll need eight, and of course that is possible. If it is nine, nine, seven, and a seven. That is thirty-two. For forty-two, you'd be needing ten. Five and five is possible, right? This is five. This is also five. Are these both cells same? So. We know that all of these cells are same. So I'll mark that with a maybe red color. This cell and this cell is same, which is equal to this cell. Of course, so these two cells are same because whatever I have here, no, uh, doesn't 
whatever I have here would have to be here would have to be here so this is 3 5 or 6 this is 1 2 or a 4 this is again 3 5 or a 6 1 2 or a 4 4 is in one of these two cells if this is 4 of course guys so I got a very good logic here we know that the sum of these two numbers is either 9 or 10 and in both the cases 4 has to be inside it for 9 you cannot have 3 and 6 both as the sum uh, because both 3 and 6 can be cannot be ruled out from these two cells so 4 has to be inside it and if it is 10 it has to be 6 and 4 so 4 is in one of these two cells that eliminates 4 from these cells amazing so this is a 4 here that eliminates 4 from this cell and 3 from this cell sum of these two numbers is 7 so that eliminates 4 from this cell as well 4 from this cell and 3 from this cell if 4 is a ruled out 3 would be ruled out from this cell so this is a 3 here okay and 3 cannot be inside this so this is 3 here so it is 5 or 6 and of course now we can actually do it so if this is 9 this is also 9 18 plus 7 and 7 uh, 32 oh no 7 7 8 and 8 no 9 and 9 i'm sorry 7 and 7 9 and 9 would give you 32 some of these two cells would have to be 10 so of course not possible if this is 10 plus 10 20 plus 7 and 7 is 34 some of these two cells would have to be 8 which means this is 5 6 amazing 3 3 that gives you a 4 here 3 under 3 here so sum is 10 right 5 or 2 6 or 1 uh, this is 4 3 oh. no I did some something I have done a wrong this is 10 and 10 so 4 and 6 so this is 5 3 3 3 and 3 this would have to be 2 1 No, I I think what I have done wrong. I can I can see that. I can see that. So I think so that we are uh, sure that four has to be none of these two cells. So this is a four. and the sum of okay uh, not sure about it yet so 4 cannot be here which means 4 cannot be here 3 cannot be here if there is a 3 here uh, okay 4 cannot be here four cannot be here so this is one two four is in one of these two cells we have already deduced so four cannot be here
so this is a three here that gives you a three here right three has to be none of these two cells so this is a three this is a three that is a four this is a four i did a small mistake there but uh, thanks a lot i could uh, just find it five and six this is one and two that is five and six so this is a four here four it would have to be five or a six four and three is not possible here so this is four one and two five and six so this is 10 it has to be 6 5 2 1 1 2 1 2 1 2 and 1 okay 3 5 and 6 so this is 6 6 5 6 5 6 5 6 okay 2 and 1 and there is 6 and 5 and that is 2 and 5 amazing we took a lot of time on this but it was really amazing i actually broke the sudoku at uh, uh, one point because i miss i assumed something wrong here with uh, the coloring here three four three five six or anything but it was an amazing sudoku really really amazing sudoku thanks a lot YouTube, for such a wonderful sudoku and i will go back with the i will go on with the second uh, sudoku which is a nine by nine so let's see what can we do here this seems to be a difficult one that's a really good here uh, seems to be a easy one I'm not sure but uh, the sum when you have four such cages in the same row the sum cannot be less than 9 and greater than 10 so it is uh, greater than 11 so it is either 9 10 or 11 red is 9 10 or 11 same way for gray as well as same way for blue amazing uh, we got the starting logic very fast the sums for gray blue and red would only be 9 10 or 11 of course they can be same as well but they cannot be same amazing they cannot be same because if you have the sum 9 for blue and 9 for gray this digit would be 9 into 4 is 36 this digit would be 9 for blue as well and 9 for gray as well so you cannot have so which means the three colors and the three sums is 9 10 and 11 and it can be in any order of course so which means if it is 9 it would be 36 which is a 9 here if it is 10 that would be 45 5 and 1 so these three cells would be 1 5 and 9 9 10 and 11 so if it is 9 10 and 11 9 cannot be in the cage so this is a 9 which means the sum for the red is 9 okay the sum for the red is 9 so if it is 9 9 9 10 and 11 so if it is a 10 for blue excuse me if it is 10 for blue you will have 20 here and 20 25 need would need to have in these three cells of course so it has to be 11 for blue if it is 11 for blue this is 1 this is 5 so the sum of these and these are 11 and 11 22 so this is 6 and 8 23 remaining amazing so blue is 11 and gray is 10 so 10 9 and 9 how much we get 1828 you need 17 more in these two cells so which is this 8 and that is 9 wow amazing guys amazing so this is one for gray we have 10 now one cannot be here so this cell uh, these three cells are one for red we have nine so one it can be two six three five
ओके फोर कैन नॉट बी हियर फॉर ग्रेट स्टैंड ओके फॉर ब्लू इट इज इलेवन राइट सो वै कैन अ सेवन बी सो दिस हैज टू बी थ्री एंड सेवन एंड टू एंड फोर so 11 plus 11 is 22 mm. 10 so it has to be 37 only 3 and 7 this 9 so it has to be 4 and 5 1 and 2 so this is 2 and a, oh 2 and a 1 So you cannot have two here. This, which means it is three and five only for the nine. So four cannot be here. So this is four and six, two and seven. This is three and six. This seems to be an easy one for now. I'm not sure if we uh, again uh, do some mistake here, but this seems to be a really good one. So one three five. So this is seven and a three here. This six gives you a eight and a six here. Four eight and nine. So nine cannot be in the nine sum cage. So it is one and five. If it is eight, it would have to be one. We already have eight here. So this is four and five. And two and a seven. Come on, what are you missing here? Sum is ten, right? So four, five. You cannot have three, six. So it's one, eight, or two, seven. And nine would have to be in one of these two cells. So three, six, or nine. This digit would have to be somewhere in these two cells, and the other digit would have to be nine. Nine cannot be in the red cells because of the nine sum, right? So if this is three six nine for the eleven sum, it has to be eight five and two. If it is three six nine for the ten sum, it would have to be seven four and one. Are missing anything? What about this sum? It is ten, right? It has to be nine, one, two, eight, three, seven, and four, six. Oh, okay, that is has to be nine and one. So both one and nine are ruled out here. So nine would have to be here, which gives you a two here. That gives you seven and two here, four and a six here. Amazing, guys! Really amazing. It couldn't have been better, guys. Such a wonderful Sudoku. Thanks a lot, you trio, for such a wonderful Sudoku. Really amazing. So, which means you need two and eight here. Two and eight can can be here. So two is not here. So this would have to be two and seven. One and eight. So which means two would have to be in one of these two cells. Two cannot be here. Uh, two can be here, right? Two and eight is possible here, or two and eight is possible here. Okay. Oh, 
or seven is also possible here. So this cell will either be two or a seven because in this column, in this row, where can you have two and seven? You cannot have here. You cannot have both two and seven here because the sum would have to be ten. So if this is two and seven, this would have to be eight and three, three and eight. the sum 11 now the sum is 11 here it cannot be uh, 28 uh, 29 38 47 this has to be 5 or a 6 Come on, we should be able to solve this now because I don't think it should be difficult. Four eight na nah, two nine pair. You got a two nine pair here. These two cells would have to be four and eight. That four gives you a five and a four here, six and a five here. It would have to be six and eight, three and seven, right? Three, four, seven. For the eleven, it would have to be eight, four, and seven. Mm, two would have to be here. Okay. Come on, we should be missing something here, not sure, but one is in one of these two cells, eight, five, nine, seven, okay. Oh no, oh no, no, that isn't helping us. Six is in one of these two cells, right? you have one here uh, nine cannot be here of course nine cannot be here so this is a nine here that gives you a two uh, eight cannot be here because then you'll have one two and eight this cell will be ruled out 8 cannot be here, 8 cannot be here, so 8 is in one of these two cells, of course, yeah, 4, 8 and 1, 8, 8 would have to be in one of these two cells, 7, 1 and 3 is also not possible, 7 is also not possible, right, because 7, 1 and 3 will be uh, ruled out, will ruling out all these, poss all the candidates from this cell, so 7 is not possible, now we come back to six if you have a six here you need five more okay possible
okay two would have to be in one of these two cells right these three cells what about one one two and eight okay so one is not in these uh, cells one is ne never here so this is one eight one cannot be with the two because then you'll have a eight here and then eight is ruled out from here so one cannot be here one cannot be here one cannot be here because of the one eight pair this is one this is eight this is four this is eight it is either three six or four five three is in one of these three cells right three cannot be here because you'll have an eight here three is in one of these three cells so three cannot be here it is four and five only right okay it's two four five so this is six here this is three here and a seven here okay come on ah so this is 4 that is 7 uh, these uh, three uh, two cells are 3 8 that 7 gives you a 2 and an 8 here ah uh, right i am right right 3 and 7 would have to be here 1 9 and 6 would have to be here this is 1 6 uh, 6 and 9 1 6 and 9 so for the 11 it has to be 2 or 5 so it has to be 6 and 5 4 and a 6 2 7 and a 2 3 and a 7 8 and a 3 1 5 and a 3 here that is a 9 here 1 and a 9 here 4 and 5 here ok we are quite solving this now five and seven right so this is five and seven and that i will give you a nine and eight here not eight an eight here so this is a five here one two this would have to be three seven and a three two and a seven four and a two one and a nine one here eight six and eight uh six and four amazing this we could solve it a bit faster but both these sudokus were amazing really amazing logic really amazing sudokus I, it couldn't have been better thanks a lot trio for such a wonderful sudokus what 6 and 6 8 by uh, 9 by 9 6 was 6 6 by 6 was quite difficult i think but i'm not sure if i missed something but both were amazing so i really thank for such a wonderful sudokus and i really appreciate if you could all uh, subscribe to our patreon page as well on shackling sudokus and puzzles we would really appreciate that we have been covering videos from past uh, three years and it's really a big effort for us to do that and we would really appreciate uh, if you could do uh, if you could uh, subscribe to our patreon page and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thank you